Alright, today I'm going to be explaining how to install a low impedance module on a Honda. This is a B16A motor. Um, what we did here is we have the low impedance module, I already mounted it on the car. Um, but the way you install it, okay, not very many people have a very clear video on how to do this. But the easiest way is by using a multimeter, alright. What you do is each injector, you got the pigtail. I don't know if you can see that very well. Well, you take them, you take the pigtails off. You take a resistor, or you know, you do a continuity check with a multimeter, and it's usually going to be the right wire on each injector. But uh, what you do is you hook it up there. You pull this little cap off. You see right here. Let's see if it'll focus on. It. There you go. This little cap. Um, let's see if I can remove it with one hand. Give me one second. I think I think was in there pretty good, but uh, <clears throat> you do a continuity test, you test from the pigtail, then you come over to this harness right here. Look, they're all yellow, so they're all the same color, so it's gonna be kind of hard to tell what is what. But uh, you do a continuity test from the pigtail, and you stick the other one in here. Let's see right here in mine uh, for the injectors, it was one, two, three, and then the top one, so it was four. It was these ones right here and the top one. All right. Well, what you do is you actually cut those wires off those off the pigtail directly in half. You got the bottom three and the top one, as you can see. I've already done so, and it's completely separate now. Okay, you cut them off, you wire them all together. And this one yellow wire runs straight to the impedance module, low impedance. Um, and the red wires, they do not matter what order you wire them up in. Okay, it does not matter as long as they all go to the injectors. So once you test it, these red wires will be going to the injectors, which determines low impedance. Okay. And uh, after that, you connect it. Um, like, like I said again, you want to take all these wires and uh, fuse them together and having it run to the one yellow wire to the low impedance module, okay? Doesn't matter what order. Uh, after you're completed with the project, you just install this little cap back on. And that's it, and that's all you need to know. So that's how you install a low impedance module. Thank you very much.